Hi everybody, we're back playing Warframe. We were going to need more and this is the final episode in the Mastery Rank series. Uh, we're going to make it through to Mastery Rank 9. And we'll do the Mastery Rank 9 test at the end of it. Using the Prisma Tetra. And I've also got the Lecter, which is a like a whip, melee weapon. The Lecter hasn't quite got the strength in it at the moment. Getting plenty of levels on the weapons at the moment, which is good. Ah, Octavia Prime Neuroptics. It's very handy. The next reward. Let's go Bazza Prime Barrel. Successful we will be. And here comes the 15 minute reward. The Venka Prime Blades. Another job well executed. All right, so we're max rank now on the Harrow. So we'll swap this one out. Let's go Excalibur. So that's only rank thirteen at the moment. Might spruce up those colours a little bit. There we go. And twin gremlins I can swap out as well. So at this point uh, I don't have any more secondary weapons so we'll have to build one. We'll have to go to the dojo and uh, find a new weapon. So I want to go to the energy lab. and see what weapons we have available. So some research has already been done in here, so I'll select uh, secondary. So you can see the spectra is available. So I'll create the blueprint for a spectra, which I think is a uh, like a beam weapon. Okay, now I can go back and uh, build it in the foundry. Choose secondary. Here it is. So you can see it needs uh, field runs, which also come from the energy lab. So I'll have to go back there. Back into the dojo. Now I need to buy a couple of field runs. So they have 15,000 each. Two of those. And then we go back to the ship and uh, go into the foundry and build the field runs. You can see each field run will take um, 12 hours to build. Okay, so when it's complete we can now build the spectra. Alright, let's equip the spectra now. Do you remember the old war, operator? All right. A fisher, defend yourself and use reactant to open walls. I see it looks like some kind of mining tool. Fallen enemies will drop crucial life support. The lookout. Here we go. Rank one. Drop 
swapping reactor. Use it to crack open a relic. Alright, so we finished that one. Let's take a look at our levels on the left. Okay, so we're back into a survival mission here. Now this group want to stay in this room and drag the enemies in. Not a bad tactic actually, just to uh, stay in this room and let them come to you. Extraction is available if you need it. You see how they're dropping all the loot at the front door? It's pretty good. Now he's saying if you stand away from line of sight, they will actually come in the room. Let's go Lemmy Skylar Prime handle. So let's stay back from the door a bit. like a kill zone there at the doorway. Getting some good levels with this too, it's good. <laughs> Lots of levels. Very nice. And lots of loot. You do a loot run occasionally, pick up all the reactant and the other loots. I think he's using the Ignis Wraith, just uh, squirting fire across the doorway. Use some of the Slash Dash on the Excalibur. Good. And they've got shielding, that's what's going on. Kill that shield generator. More we'll slash dash. into the loot room. I'm getting lots of levels this way, it's pretty good. Good group. 
Ah, nice. Nezza Prime Neuroptics, the gold reward. That looks like a rare item. Death Cube Prime Blueprint. I have to say I'm loving this group. <laughs> this is very efficient. I'm not showing you all of it of course, I'm just showing you a few of the highlights. Okay, 20 minute reward. The Breton Prime I don't have. A 25 minute reward. Let me Scala Prime handle. Karis Prime handle. So it's 30 minutes. Dreamers, I have for you a tale of triumph over adversity. Of one wow, we got max rank on all of those. <laughs> Everything except for the Excalibur. That was pretty good. So now let's uh, swap out some of these. The Penta, this is an odd weapon, it's like a Grenade launcher. And we can get Xenostar. Now we have to get another secondary. Because the Spectra is maxed out. Let's see what secondaries we have. The Cycron and the Cyan X. I'll just kick those off researching. So they're not quite ready yet. Have to contribute the uh, research parts. Get those guys researching. Okay, so those two are researching. Uh, we can get the dual Sestra though, that looks pretty good. Let's replicate one of those. Okay, now we can go back to the foundry and build it. Okay. So we'll select these two Sestra to use to build a twin Sestra. Or dual Sestra. 24 hours to build. Okay, that's done now. Let's uh, equip it on the secondary. Alright, let's go. Now the Penta is a strange weapon that's uh, like a grenade launcher. You are going to need more 
and then you hit the middle mouse button to explode the grenades. It's like a two-step thing. It's quite odd. Located the hostage. Escort the prisoner to the extraction point. Alta, rest. But uh, I guess you know, with this strategy, we're just looking for random weapons to uh, level and increase. Mission complete. The captive has been liberated. You will be rewarded for this, Tenno. Yeah, we've got the first few levels there. Search for the hostage and bring them Here's home. the next one. Watch out! I'm detecting void missions nearby. Do you have a matching relic? A fisher. Defend yourself and use a reactor to open relics. Let's go on the offensive. Use that reactant to open a relic. You are going to need more reactant if you want to open that relic. We fought with honor. Can't leave without rescuing the prisoner. Keep searching. Oh yeah. <laughs> I like the dual sisters already. Very fast fire rate. Yeah, it's good. Seems pretty effective too. Just needs a bit more uh, damage. It'll be good. Okay, we're coming to the end. Titania Prime Neuroptics. Mission complete. Excellent work, Tenno. Okay, so we've got about 11 levels there. Now we're doing exterminate. Defend yourself and use reactant to open relics. They're dropping reactant. Use it to crack open a relic. I have to say I'm loving the jewel sister. Find more. Got a very slow reload on it though. Need to boost the reload speed with the mod of course. It really is a lot of fun. Watch yourself. Grenier are on the way. So the dual sister is mastery rank 7, so if you're mastery rank 7 you should give it a try. Me the prime neuroptics. Another job well executed. We got rank twelve on two of those. So the Excalibur's now max. So let's choose Mag or Necros. Probably Necros. Another group. 
void fishers. You need them to open a relic, but are you confident you can withstand their fury? You found a fisher. Look out for reactant. Use that reactant to open a relic. Don't forget reactant. You need them to open that relic. That was a close one. There we go. The relic has been cracked open. Finish your mission to find out what's inside. So we're nearly done with the enemies. Okay, exit. X Stiletto Prime Blueprint, that's nice. Gold reward. So that's a rare item. Another job well executed. Ballistics and archaic weapons are really dangerous, just like the grenade. There are void fissures in the area. Use these to crack open a relic. Oh, no, you don't. You're near a fissure. Use that reactant to open a relic. A slow reload. <laughs> just have to dance around while you're reloading your weapon. Now get to extraction. Okay, extract we will. Rank 15 on the Sestra. Here's the next one. Piston Prime Receiver. Job well executed. Rank 16. Coming to the end of another mission. Strike. Broken. Well done. Now get to extraction. Okay, Ivara Prime Blueprint. Another job well executed. You found it. Look out for reactant. I have to say, I can't get used to this penta weapon, that's very strange. <laughs> I'm quite slow. The capture target has vital information that we will need to extract. We need our subject brought back alive. Use that reactant to open a relic. The reactant is working on your relic. Find more. Torpedo Prime. So we're about halfway up. There used to be builders, but now all they make is war. Back in another group there. Jeff, protecting void fishers nearby. Do you have a matching relic? 
You're near a fissure. The enemies are dropping reactant. The reactant is working on your relic. Find more. So I guess by this you're sort of gauging uh, how much grindage is happening with this uh, Mastery Rank 9 level. Zooge Prime. It is a bit of grindage to get there. But it's worth it in the end. Okay, so we've gotten there, we've reached the uh, the point where we can do the test for rank 9. So we'll go to the Strata Relay. And now we fast travel to Cephalon Samaris. And on the right here we can uh, do the practice test. If I can find the right uh, cubicle. No, this one here. So let's do the practice. Now this Mastery Rank 9 test is quite hard. Attack is not always the best option. Using your stealth abilities, eliminate all enemies without being detected. So it did take me four or five goes to work out how to do this in the right sequence. So if you're up to doing this one, uh, pay attention. <laughs> Yep, don't do that. <laughs> I tried to uh, get him undetected. Let's try again. This is just the practice, so it uh, doesn't matter too much. There we go. On to the next phase. So bullet jump over to here. Swing around here, get the other guy. And then we wait under the bridge for a bit. Got to wait for the planets to align. So he walks down that way to the left. So when he appears um, above that ramp there, you can sneak in behind him. over and get the other guy. Okay, that's the second phase done. Let's do the third phase. This one's a bit trickier. Let's jump behind this pillar. circle again. Just wait here. Right, go in behind him. Jump. Jump down. And that's it guys, easy. <laughs> no, it's not easy. It did take me five or six tries to get the sequence right. Now that we've done that, we can do it for real now. Let's do the real thing. A full frontal attack is not always the best option. Using your stealth abilities eliminate all enemies without being detected. Yeah. 
phase one. Wait here. Okay, that's phase two. This guy. And we're done. And that is the end of Mastery Rank 9. Oh, and we're spinning for some reason. <laughs> that's the end of this episode guys I hope you liked the uh, Master Rank series and uh, please like and subscribe and we'll see you in the next episode bye for now Thank mm -hmm. you.